Complete all hand hygiene and infection control processes before starting. Ask the person to sit upright with their feet over the edge of the chair or plinth. For muscle strength test, first we'll look at ankle dorsiflexion. Place one hand on the top of the foot and the other above the ankle for support. Gently push the foot down and ask the person to try and push in the opposite direction against your hand. For ankle plantar flexion, place one hand on the bottom of the foot and the other above the ankle for support. Gently push the foot upwards and ask the person to try and push in the opposite direction against your hand. If they're unable to do this, reduce the amount of pressure you're applying and check if that is more suitable. To assess the person's range of motion, ask them to do the same movements, although do not apply any resistant pressure. To assess the person's strength of big toe extension, stabilize the foot with one hand. Put your fingers on top of the person's big toe. Ask them to pull back with their big toe against the resistance. Test flexion strength by applying gentle pressure on the bottom of the toe and ask the person to push against it. To assess the person's range of motion, ask them to do the same movements, although do not apply any resistant pressure. Ensure to accurately complete these tests, it is done directly in an up and down direction and not to either side. Now that you have completed these findings for one foot, repeat the same process on the other foot. Again, test ankle dorsiflexion, ankle plantar flexion, big toe extension, and big toe flexion. Compare the muscle strength for each of these from one foot to the other. There are terms to describe the position of the foot. This position is inversion, neutral, and eversion. After you have completed any tests, it is important you explain the findings to the person. This helps them understand what you have been doing, what you have found, and what actions are required. Based on your findings, discuss and agree with what actions you will undertake. This may include referral to other services. After this, discuss and organise a follow-up appointment.